Congratulations, Coach. Uh, Thank you, Robert. The way you woke up this morning expecting this game to go, but uh, <laughs> quite the, uh, the exciting finish. You don't often get to see goalkeepers win the game on both sides of a penalty kick shootout. Um, kind of walk me through the uh, just sort of the, the, the emotions and the, and the, the post game conversations you had with the players after such a long night and, and such a wonderful victory. No, you can imagine the emotions in the look room. So, win a, another game in the US Open Cup here at Seattle with this unique atmosphere that they have. And play against Seattle, doesn't matter the team that they put on the field, is difficult always. So, the guys are very, very happy. It's important, this victory. Thank you, Alex. Uh, Fabian Renkel. Congratulations on the win in Seattle. Thank you, uh, Fabian. You're off, to a, you're, you're off to a blazing hot start. You've won four out of your last five matches as a head coach. How do you feel? Well, I, I, feel, I feel good. I feel good. They, the guys won. We try to, to help them as much as we can, you know, but at the end they are playing, so uh, they have the credit. They have the credit. So I, I, I feel very good, obviously. Like, uh, I think all the coaches, when, when, the, when their, team, their teams are winning, they feel joy. So we feel good. It's, it's, it's an important game because also, at the same time, you play Wednesday and you have to go to Vancouver, you know, and, and even if sometimes the performance has not to... Um, it's normally, or sometimes the performance and the result are not in the same path, you know, uh, it's important to win in order to face Vancouver with uh, that, uh, that state of mind. That state of mind. Thank you, Alex. Um, Ane, do you have a question? Uh, Robert Jonas? Yeah, um, I, I want to kind of follow up with, uh, you know, just to, to talk about Matt Persano. Um, in a lot, of, a lot of these Open Cup games, you know, we see a lot of the players that aren't getting regular minutes uh, feature, get the start, get their opportunities. You know, for Matt, who really hadn't played in a, in a game like at the Major League level uh, for, for, well, a long, long time. Um, can you talk about his performance tonight from <coughs> playing the entire game, making some incredible saves to, to keep the uh, Seattle off the board at the end of the first half, and just the, the, the heroic performance he put in there at the end to... to uh, to get the victory. He made the one save he had to make, and he, he made the one goal he had to make. So, you know, please, uh, let, let us, let, give us a little insight into, into Matt Persano. No, I have talked with Matt uh, lately, since uh, with our staff we came in, you know, Matt Bersano has a lot of history inside the club. He's an important player, even if, so, if, if, if he's difficult as a goalie, you know, because um, there is a big competence. I think that today he had a solid performance. Um, he deserved it. He deserved to play, and, and we saw the result. You know, he did great. He saved the team in, in, in the moments that he had to, and I think that also he was uh, confident with the ball on, on, on his feet. So, so happy for Matt. So, so happy. And for the rest of the guys, right? But uh, as you said, Matt uh, had a long, uh, was a long, long time that he didn't play. Thank you, Alex. Let's go to Jamin Moore. Hi Alex. Hi Alex, thanks for uh, joining us tonight, it's good to see you. Um, what uh, was interesting to me is kind of how things worked out in the end, had some really, really good penalty kicks out there, you know, before the game wire mark fire part of the game. Um, given, given these open cup matches, why are the uh, overtimes sometimes and, uh, the, you know, having to take these penalty kicks, how much did that factor into your plans around the substitutes? Were you trying to win? Regulation, or were you thinking just in case you needed to play overtime, uh, how you'd want to play? Hi, Jamon. Um, well, no, I think that we, we made the substitutions uh, thinking about the game, you know, and thinking about the, that we have another game to play um, Saturday, today is Wednesday, uh, we, ha we don't have too much time to, to train during the week. Um, and we thought that it uh, was a good uh, moment to, to make these substitutions. We were not thinking the penalty kicks. 
and there is a is an interesting history behind the penalty geeks decisions tonight. Thank you. We'll take one last question from Fabian Rankel. Thank you for taking the second question, coach. With Sacramento, LAFC, and LA Galaxy in the next round, which teams do you feel their place are best suited to play against in that round? Thank you. Doesn't matter. At this point, the competition like that, like US Open Cup, you go one game and can happen whatever. It doesn't matter the, the level of the, the, the team. It's going to be a very, very competitive game. So we are here and let's see against who do we have to play and we will play with, uh, with our 101% like always. These guys are working hard, very, very hard.